Hey, this is Anthony from Zoli. Come on, decide and ride. Welcome to our detailed breakdown of the new Dianese Tivoli and Toady jeans available at Revzilla.com. To my left, you can't see him, but this is Juice. And Juice is rocking the new Dianese Tivoli jean. Now, in the intro, we called out the Tivoli as well as the Toady jean because Giant Dianese, for around the $200 mark at this stage of the game, moving into 18, is really making two jeans, very similar composition, only differing in their cut. The Tivoli to my left is going to be more of a regular fit with a slight taper in the leg, whereas the toady is going to be, toady, I love it, T-O-D-I, is going to be more of your slimmer cut. They both come in a dark as well as a medium wash. They're both going to use 98% cotton, 2% elastane, and what I like about these jeans is that they have reinforcement in aromatic panels at the hips as well as the seats. They also come with Pro Shape Armor from Dionese, which comes stock that's worked into the knees. So on both jeans, you can remove it, and you can add Pro Shape Soft Armor to the hips as well. Now, if I had to call out a nitpick, as much as I love the four pocket design, the construction, and this is gonna be that, di that darker wash on the Tivoli, what we don't have is any kind of aromatic backing or Kevlar style backing at the knee. You just get it at the hip and the seat. I guess Dionysia was looking through the lens of we're adding the Pro Shape armor, but there are, I know there are gonna be riders out there that take that armor out and to have a little bit of additional slide protection to the knee would be a great thing when I think through the lens of the next iteration possibly. Now, quick note on sizing as I look at my dark wash here on the Tivoli. Remember, this is going to be the more regular fit with a slight taper. I have Juice to my left. He's 5'10", 195, but he's actually, like, while he does work out from the waist down, he's not overly bulky. He's a 32-inch jeans waist. He's about a 33, 33 and a half inch uh, belly button waist. We have him wearing a size 33. And ultimately, even with that stretch, 2%, that makes a big difference in this jean, we went up about an inch on the waist to give him additional coverage, knowing that this is more of a European style fit. Now, if we look at the way that this works, you do have a bit of an extra panel on the crotch that adds to the ergonomics when you're riding. You do have a sleeve on a diagonal really working its way in with that knee pocket, but ultimately you're getting your base mobility on the Tivoli or the Toady jeans really out of the elastane material that is worked in. So use the size charts, ping us if you have any questions. Ultimately, we'll ship for free over 39 bucks. But I'd also love it if you click our logo, subscribe to us to on our YouTube channel, leave me your comments, your questions, your feedback on the Toady or the Tivoli jean. Now, diving into other nuance on this jean, notice there's no rivets. It's very thoughtful from Dianese. There's nothing metallic to scratch the paint or scratch your fairing. You do have a button at the top. It is a button fly, which I am a fan of. It makes a little bit more work, but I think it works better from a style standpoint. As you work your way down, you're gonna see basics here on the jean. Juice, turn the face away from me. You see the jean breaking down the bottom of his right leg? That's over top of the new Raptor from Dionese, one of their hardcore riding shoes. What I do love is you have a little bit of a cuff down here, and when you flip it over, you're gonna get 3M Scotch Light Reflective. That tape right there, which does go up a few inches in case you have to hem these jeans, use a tailor to do it, it's 20 bucks, it's cheap to get the right exact fit for the inseam. He, by uh, way of inseam, is going to be 32 to 33 inches, keep that in mind, but you do have that reflective safety feature. And you can see some contrast stitching down the side, the dark version is going to use a yellowed stitching. Turn backwards for me, Juice. The pockets on the Tivoli are a little bit more European inspired. They do have a little bit louder stitching, notice, triple stitching across the top. You notice the way that everything is set up. It's meant to be in the riding position. And again, you do have reinforcement with aromatic panels across the street, across the seat, moving into the hip. But again, you don't have that across the knee. Come back around to the front. So keep in mind, we're thinking about these two jeans. The Divoli is going to come in a medium and a dark wash. It's going to be more regular with a tapered fit, whereas your toady is going to be more of your slim fitting jean. Again, a little bit more stretch oriented, a little bit tighter, a little bit more hipster. But again, going down into that realm being a little bit more retro inspired, I would expect them to have at least two flavors of these jeans. The next step in your journey is to click the info button, the desktop, the mobile device. Visit the product detail page at RevZilla.com. Read other rider reviews on these two jeans. You shouldn't just take my word for it. As always, we'll ship for over 39 bucks. You want to talk to a gear geek, see us at RevZilla.com or 877792 9455. Thanks for watching our detailed breakdown. Remember, subscribe to us at RevZilla on our YouTube channel. Stay up to date with our opinion of the latest and greatest in the motor universe. I'm Anthony. We'll see you next time.